Hey everyone, in this video we're going to go over the Key Search Explorer tool. What the Explorer tool does is it's basically a one-stop shop to give you a ton of information about any domain or web page. When you first load it up, you'll see the search bar here. You can put in a domain and uh, or a specific web page. If you're doing a specific page, you set it to specific page. Otherwise, leave it set to entire domain. Then you do your search and it'll come up with just a ton of information here. You have your uh, domain strength, which is basically key searches score for how strong we see your domain currently. Um, this number will co uh, coincide with the score to target, which is basically the highest um, keyword difficulty score we feel you should be targeting. Once again, this is just a suggestion. You can you know, decide for yourself what you think, but um, this just basically gives you a guideline of how strong your domain seems to be and how high of keyword difficulty scores it seems your site might be able to rank for. Then we have our uh, backlinks numbers here, referring domains, um, some do file, no file breakdown, and some other info uh, relating to the backlink strength of the domain or web page. Here you'll see you have your organic keywords. Uh, count how many organic keywords we found. Basically, that's how many keywords we found your website uh, ranking on Google for. An estimated traffic number. Once again, this is just estimated. Don't get too hung up on this. It, it should be used more for comparison than a definite estimate of how much traffic you're getting from Google. We're dependent on uh, search volumes, which can vary, click percentages per position. So there's a lot of factors that go into it, but it's really just an estimate. So don't get too hung up on that. Then you could click here to view the uh, top ranking keywords um, for the domain. You'll see when it comes up, it gives you the position, uh, the search volume for the keyword, the traffic, you have CPC, you could sort by these columns. It shows you which URL we found ranking for that keyword and a keyword score. Uh, we don't have keyword scores for every keyword, but we have for most of them. So uh, if it's missing, you'll see and not available, but otherwise you can sort by the keyword score. It's just a great way to Check out your competitors, see what they're ranking for, see what keywords you might be able to uh, pick off from them, stuff like that. So this is an awesome tool right here, and it could take you straight to the organics keywords page where you can dive in even deeper to uh, looking into the ranking keywords for any uh, website or web page. Then we have the top pages. Once again, this is based off the estimated traffic. So it may not be exactly right, but it should give you an overall idea of what the most trafficked pages are for whatever website um, you're searching. Um, and you'll see here the estimated traffic for the page. And then once again, you can open that specific page in Explore or the organic keywords section. Then we have a backlinks overview graph, which shows you how your backlinks have grown or not over time. A traffic overview, which gives you um, an overview of your traffic over time and keywords. Um, you can see the keywords are in blue and you can see how things have grown or changed. Um, it looks like we got a big boost around April there. Then we list your top competitors. You can click on the view competitors, which will then go load top 20 instead of the top five. And you'll see it shows you the domain strength of the competitor, the amount of incoming links to the domain, um, the amount of incoming domains to the domain, the key, the amount of keywords uh, we see ranking. So this is a cool way to um, just check out what we see as your biggest competitors in, in the search results. Here we got a top um, referring domains by domain strength. Once again, you could view more similar to how the top competitors. You got your ranking distribution, which shows uh, how your keywords break up into where we see them ranking, like how many keywords are ranking in the top three, how many rank four through 10 and so on. And then your top anchor text um, breakdown. And once again, you could uh, view more anchor text. It'll bring up another pop-up that'll view the anchor text. If you want to view the specific backlinks, you could click the view backlinks and then it'll bring you to the backlink checker page and just um, automatically open whatever uh, website or web page you were searching. Here's the history, so you could uh, open past results. Once again, here's uh, a page we searched, so was, uh, I'll show you a specific web page. So this loads up 
this specific page. Once again, if you're doing specific page, you need to set this to the specific page right there. And this shows our um, brainstorm niche ideas page and all the same basic information. It's just instead of on a domain level, it's just on a page level. So there's a ton you can do with this, especially when it comes to re researching your competitors. Um, there's a million different ways you could use this information, but it's an awesome tool, gives you a full overview of basically anything you need to look into, and it should be a, uh, become a big part of your keyword research and competitor um, research process. But that's about it for the Explorer tool. I will uh, see you guys in the next video.